so today we are discussing updating or adding column in a data frame in the last video we have seen about the row similarly we'll look at how we can update the values of a column or how we can add a new column okay so first of all we have created a data frame here that is df with five rows and three columns now we are trying to change the value update the value of column one using df square bracket and i have put the value that is column one it was a label string value so i've given it in the quotes and i've given equals to zero so what happened all the values of the column one became zero this was a scalar value given okay now similarly i want to re give these value i want to again put these values so what i give i put df dot call one this method could also be used df dot call one i am using to update it now what I, what is happening that i give the list of the values that i want to give and again these values are assured in the column one okay similarly now we'll look at adding a new column using the brackets and dot method we'll also look so if we have this df you can easily look at now i want to add a call for so what i give df square bracket call for it is a string label equals to zero so a new column with all the values zeros is added here now similarly i'm using df dot column name to add a new column so what it do df dot call five i want to create a call five and i give a list of value but it say gives a warning it is not doing so now i again trying try by giving a scalar df dot call five equals to zero now in the output you can look, uh, look at that no new column is added here that means using df square bracket we can add a new column we can update the value but using df dot column name we can just update the column but could not add a new column right now updating a column using df dot lock now we have the df we can look at we have through five rows and four columns both one is recently added now df dot lock i put colon comma call two i want to update the values of call two but in all the rows because i want to update all the rows i put colon in lock what is the syntax row comma column so in the row from the start to end i want from the start to the end to update so i put these two dots the first designate the start value then colon the end value i have not given these values so it will update all okay and i want to update column two so i put it equals to zero we can only give labels here then you know the user defined index because it is lock so what it do i give equals to zero that is a scalar value it updated the column two with the zero value right similarly now updating i want to again give the values which were there but one two or three teen columns ki value mein using df dot lock dobara wohi dalna chahta hu jo thi so what i do row 1 colon row 3 now this is lock so no n minus 1 is followed row 1 to 3 it will update at column 2 so i put values in list 2 5 8 so what it do 2 5 8 are again updated replacing the zero now the 4 and 5 i'll update using i lock now because it is i lock i cannot give the label index user defined index i have to give the implicit index the automatically generated index which is always in the back end right it might not be visible so what i did df dot i lock 3 colon i have not given a value when i don't give a value that means still end what was the so was zero from uh, the index start from zero zero row one row two row three row i want to update the row four and five so i give three row so i put three here colon i could put five here i lock works with n minus 1 rule i could put five or i can just leave it blank so it will work till the end right it will update also five right comma one i want to update the column to zero is column one and column two is one index so i put one here and i want to update two values so i put 11 comma 14 in a list so we can see here that these values are updated right 11 and 14 are updated here they are replacing zero now adding a new column using df dot lock and df dot i lock method we see that now we have used first of all df dot lock method i want to create a new column okay 
and I want to give values for all the rows here. So I put what? I put col only colon, comma, column 5. So what it is, I give the list of values which I want to give. Please assure that the list of values should be in concordance to the five rows. Because there are five rows, I am giving five values. Otherwise, I can give a scalar value also like 0. Okay, so what it do? It added a new column called 5 with the given value. But now when I use I log for the same purpose, I used I log all the rows I want to give a value for and I want to create a, you know, a new column at the fifth place. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now I want to create at the fifth index a new column. Okay, and I give value what a scalar zero, but it gave me an error. What is the error? That I lock cannot enlarge its target object. Lock can enlarge the object, but I lock cannot. That means I lock cannot add a new column to it. Okay, only lock can. Okay, and I at and at can only update one single value. We have seen at a particular row in a particular column, so we cannot use it to add a new column or a Role. So this was all for today. Thank you. To, at Telegram, you can follow us for the study material, notes, PPTs, etc. The link is in the bio or description.